Hello everybody, hope you've had a good day. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to uh, the second, uh, no, it's not second, Jesus Christ, the second game of Escape First, like Escape First 2. I think that's what this one is, and is it? Escape First 2, yes it is. But yeah, I think I'm going to maybe do, I might, and I haven't seen anything about the game, obviously. But if it turns out the game has the the levels that it did last like last time the rooms i think i'm gonna chop it into different parts instead so i i didn't like how i did last one was two hours i thought i don't really like doing two hours i sometimes it happens just happens when it's like a playthrough of a game but i, I try not to and i don't like it don't really like to do that but I, if it ends up being m multiple rooms like that i think i'll divide them up and do each room as a part but yeah, if you end up enjoying, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you already. It'd be very much appreciated. But yeah, let's just see. And is it mod? Yes, it is. Psycho Circus 2, Escape Room Factory, and the Torture Chamber. Yeah, so it, it's going to be a three part uh, series for this game. Looks a bit there. Said, uh. I mean, I was about to make a disclaimer, but it may be a bit right. That I've just got a new controller, so I was like, maybe look out for a bit awkward gameplay from me, but it's not really going to be much worry, so we should be good. You know, just a breaking, so literally, first time using this controller. But let's just start with... Oh, wait. You managed to... Es oh, it's a... It's carry on. You managed to escape the clown's quarters, but not you are not free yet. Did you think it would be easy to escape? The show must go on, and you are the exhibit. Think, act, and fast in order to skip the circus. We all know that counts don't like people touching the stuff. Okay. Yes, yeah, just go for it. Quick start. Hopefully you can do a bit better this time. Okay. Got a poster there. Keypad there. Okay, I noticed that. Same like normal controls, that's fine. Nothing too f interesting there. Oh, something dropped. Oh god, zoom in please, what is this? A ticket with Hank. Seat 5, row 3. I'm most likely going to need to remember that, so... Here's a ticket. Also a number there. So I'm guessing that's the room I escaped from. I don't like how dark that is. Um... Hmm... I don't like how dark that is. Interesting. Alexander the Magician. The Mad Clown bite us now. Get the chance to meet the Mad Clown. Okay. Can't do anything with that. So um, I think it's something to do with that, maybe. But Inge how am I already? I just don't know where to begin. I mean, I've not seen anything. I only have two numbers so far. Is there anything on any of these posters? The twins. A chance to meet the man who's behind the mad clown. 1939. Wait, what? I say nine and five. Why 1939? 1935. 1993. Right. 
I think I may have to click a hint just so I know where I'm starting from. Because I've... I'm not seeing anything that I can stand. I don't even stand that. I'm not seeing anything other than the ticket. I'm not seeing anything to indicate a door number. There's no pattern in any of the posters. Oh, it's circled. That's a... Mark. Maybe try 1939 on one of them. 19... Nope. Wait, what? Oh, it's a big number, so it's... Um, what was it? What, was it? what match was it? 11. 11... 19... That's the sound you made before when you... Is it now? No? I thought, psh, is it this door? Okay. I feel like it should be, though. Am I just doing something wrong with it? Hang on. So they've, they've changed that, they've, he changed the ding. March is January, February, March. So March is third. Wait, 11 I'm a, I, I feel like I'm, I have to find something wrong. Oh crap, is it? Is it American? I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have to do a hint. I'm sick. So... Well, this is a fantastic start. It just say March, doesn't it? March, yeah. 11th of March. 11.03. 1999. Two numbers apply. That's why 11.03.39 works. Because you're gonna do a little bit of abbreviated, you know, you're not gonna do the whole four digits at the end. You're not gonna put the decade, realistically, if if you're in that year, not century. I think I might have to cheat. January, February, March. March is three. Yes. Oh. Three. No. Nine. I feel like it has to be this, but I did. I before someone's like, "What? You... No, I was doing that." That is. I had it. That's great. Another ticket. For Harold. Feet. Five. Row four. Wait. Are they? Are they right next to each other? Seat five. Row. Yeah. Literally the, the same seat. Just on different rows.
Okay. Right, I can deal with that, okay. We're looking for something with... The friction... No. I'm crouching because it's easier to see. What? How, how much have we got? Four digit code. Any post? Anything that has? Oh wait, do I just decide for this, actually? No, there's only one of each. Wrong. No. Then that goes with a. Which is that one? C. T. W. A. R. See, that can't spell a word because they wouldn't have one of each. That just um... was there anything else in there? Nope. Anything else on these tickets? Hank. Is there? Nope. Um. I'm annoyed about the box already. I just didn't turn it. Stupid. Um. Why are all the faces crossed out? I mean, that's most likely the room I came out to. I mean, not technically, but yeah. Plot-wise. Am I... Um... I think I'm gonna have to do another hint. The first one doesn't count, so. They make very loud sounds these cardboard boxes do when they hit something. So, I mean, I assume I'm trying to find four symbols. I don't know what they're there for. Do you know, hang on, where's, where's me fucking stupid, where's me, get, get me phone, where's me notes, hang on. Give me a note, hang on. Piss off. Okay. What have we got again? What was it? It started with, started with an R. Then it went O. Then it went L. 
Actually, give me full capital so I can... And then... Sorry, we have L. And then we have... E. And then N. Rollin. Because that's an actual... Rollin. That actually works. I'm going to double check it is. Um, where's R again? Uh, o. L. E. And yeah, that works, yeah. Then we've got, it starts with a C. T. And then W. Flower, which is an A. And then we have an R. That can't, no, that can't be really. C, T, W, A. Oh, it is, yeah. Roland. Roland Citoire. Anything Roland Citoire? Roland Citoire? Anyone's got Roland Citoire? Roland Citoire? That can't be. Rolling C12. 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 Rol
None of them make sense. How long have we got left? Two minutes. I've, got, I've actually got nothing. I think I am going to cheat. What's the most escape first? Escape first too. I mean, I'm, I'm going to have to cheat because I'm not going to be able to get this. On the box right next to you, find a ticket for Hank, yes. Wait, what? So, so, hang on, wait, what? Hang on. What? What? I the sorry there's no there's no yeah. There's no increase in the What the fuck are they on about? I now I now understand I, I'm okay now that is that is a pit that has pissed me off if that No, I can't see anything the first one was like we should explain it right I'm just using uh, the walkthrough king that I've used before for a cut another map it literally right uh, When you said open open it to find the tick of Harold and a code of symbols That's what we've done the symbols here match on the hats. Yes, that's fine. And on our boxes, on the boxes on the right, you find the Hank ticket. That's the one we just did there. The ones that were like somewhere here. Because Harold was in the thing, but Hank, yeah. Then it says, scratched on the wall near the far end, you will see a grid of marks linked by a line. No, I actually don't. That is actually stupid. I would very much like to... I mean, technically, I think this game is like a, quite a few years old now, actually. But I would definitely like to say, what the fuck are you doing? You, I cannot see any grid of lines marked anywhere. If it's here, you can fuck yourself. Cause the fuck am I supposed to do? Yes, I actually can't. I physically can't do this. That's actually what a what a terrific that is. So I'm not missing anything, am I? No. Scratched on the wall near the far end, you will see a grid of marks linked by a line. If you assume the marks represent hats, you can trace out the word clown. Go to the door with a keypad at the far end and enter the code clown. 
Right, put my phone away. Clown. I do not like your new system you got with that. I mean, I take it it's supposed to be here. But that is atrocious. Oh, we got another one. Seat two, row four for Edith. Why can I grip that? No, okay. They're all price, okay. Tickets, please. Circus this way. Why have you made it so decrepit, Dice? Wait, you just was seat two, row four. Edith was... Oh, Edith was like this one. Have we got another ticket? Bring it out into the fucking light, because this stupid brightness. Nicholas, seat two, row three. I had to know who else in here knows about this massacre. So I looked around. This is from my point of view. Two rows behind me, in the exact same seat as mine, sits a man with a hat and a fake beard. Two seats on his left, sits a woman I know from my own show. At the same seat as her, but in the first row, sits the director, and next to him, on his left, his wife. So I need to figure out who looks like who. Yeah? There's a lock there, maybe a key. I actually am going to say this, by the way. The brightness of this game actually is pissing me off. You don't mind me saying. This actually just made it so much noise. I don't. I really don't like the brightness for this fucking level. Um, a hat, a cage, a couple of balls. I actually, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit myself. Honestly, I'm gonna hit myself another hint. I don't even care. Look for the tickets and find which person stands out. Becky, seat five, row two. Victor, seat to row one. I would say Olivia, a double double one. Seat one, row two. I would say Olivia. Would you not say Olivia? The two... I, I, I'm actually confused. Look, now... Look for the tickets and find which person stands out. How in...
Maybe it's either going to be you. Which is row one, seat two, which was someone. Gilbert. Any of these called Gilbert? No. I'm actually lost. Like, I, I haven't got anything. I, I've only managed to find... I mean, I've done... what This is the third puzzle in this, this section. I managed to do the first one, but because of the system he's got now with you pulling up, I didn't pull it up far enough so it didn't fucking register. He's got a stupid mark somewhere in the dark. You can't even see it. And now I have no idea what I'm supposed to do again. Look for... Sorry, how am I supposed to look for someone who stands out via tickets that I, are identical? What am I actually supposed to... Nicholas could be as well, because he's a double two. Look for the tickets and find which person stands out. Is there is there a seat that... Is there a chair that doesn't... Ex no, they all actually have a seat. I mean, he says there's a seat that's missing and there's a ball here, but... Oh, is there a seat for Sylvia? No, there isn't. Same, um, I'm hating this. But I'm guaranteed there's someone watching this being like, oh, it's so obvious. No, it's not. It's, it's not. Stand, I'm like, oh, okay, stand out. I mean, there's a standing room seat somewhere, the seat that doesn't exist, so it's that one. I mean, that's the only one that stands out, but what am I supposed to do with the one that stands out? That one could be the one that stands out, but I don't think we have one for a... Row 3, seat 5. Do we have a row 3, seat 5? We have one for Hank, Hank, Hank. Could be Hank. What am I supposed to do with a name? Hank. I am. Um... Two rows behind me in the exact same seat. So I'm looking for, a, okay, a man in a seat, two seats behind someone. Hang on, hang on, I can do this. Okay, I'm, I can make it now. Let me try this. Right, two seats behind. So it's either... It might be Nicholas. He's the only one with a two. It's from it's Nicholas's point of view. He's the only one with a two. So it, then it goes to Jacob. And then two seats on his left. Sorry, no, yeah, two rows behind him, yeah. And then two seats to his left. Oh, I know I've done it wrong. Shit, hang on. So it could be Gilbert. It could be anyone, actually, even row-wise. Shit. That's... Um, which one is... Which one is... If it's... 
if it's two rows behind, it can't be. Do you think it's one? Two, is one two a per? Is one one? Row one, seat two, is Gilbert. It might be him because of the, the way the chair's knocked down. So if we go with that, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give this. This is this is my only attempt. I'm going to have to make. Okay, so we, we start with Gilbert, so we do that, and then he says, two rows behind, so we, so we start from Gilbert, in the exact same row, in that same seat, two rows behind is a man. So it cannot be Gilbert. Oh, it... Are we Becky? Are we Becky? No, I can't be Becky because two rows behind. But the exact same seat. Oh, and it can be Becky. Becky and then to Harold. We have to look for the two seats behind. No, it can't be that. Yeah, I think it's be Becky and then Harold. Okay, we go Becky to Harold. Then two seats on his left. So it's a woman. So Harold. Two seats to his left. Does that go to a three? Is it, is it, sorry, am I just... No, it can't be five. So it has to be two seats on his right. So it can't be Harold. Two rows behind me in the exact same... So people who have two seats in common. So we rule out... We rule out Olivia Gilbert... And Jacob... We're looking for someone, two seats in this, no, in two rows behind, in the same seat. So we look at the twos. We could be Victor. We could be Victor. Victor's the only other one. Okay. Victor is because Victor's the only other one. So we're Victor. Two rows behind me in the exact same seat. So Victor is... So we have Victor at seat two, row one. Wait, isn't that the one that was knocked over in the front row? Oh my god, it was. Oh my god, it is. It is Victor. Two rows behind me. On the exact same seat. Sorry, two, yeah, two rows behind in the same seat is Nicholas. So we're now Nicholas. Two seats is to his left. So it's a woman, so it's on row three, seat five. Which already has been scrapped because now it's Hank. So it can't be him. So now we're already gone. Okay. I'm now, I'm now back to being lost. Um, is it ew. It's, it's two people with the same seats. 
but then it has to be two rows behind. I'm actually confused, but we don't it would have to be But that's the thing is though, the seat wise there's only there's only fucking Jacob that it could be for the two seats on his left. So I would have to be I'm I'm just gonna have to wink it out for it, right? We're now just gonna fuck it. Edith is next. Edith is row four, seat two. Victor. Are we back to Victor? Uh, okay, I'm just going to... So Victor's the director. And his left... Is Olivia. I'm guessing I'm going to go with Olivia. That's my answer. Just from purely... Fucking going for it. I have no idea what they're for. It's it's Olivia. I have no idea what that entails though and why I need that. That I, I don't understand this room. Maybe someone did not tip properly. What? What are you fucking on about? What? What are you... F why have you... Inco Sorry, why the fuck have I suddenly got tips included into this? What? I'm 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 actually gonna I'm gonna cheat again. I'm fucking lost. Okay. All right. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna um, come on, what for king? Go through the curtains and find a note on the corner of the ray seating area. Gives me achievement, apparently. Read the note, then search around for more tickets. You should find tickets. For all the guests mentioned in the ticking booth. Grab the wrench from the stage and go back to the counter and use it to break open the tip jar. That explains why I could interact with that. Maxwell. Well, Max was the only one who isn't even recorded in the book. Seat two, row two. I carry this with me. Seat two. Oh, is he the no? Oh, do I go from him? Seat two, row two. Hang on. Right. We are going from Maxwell's seat two, row two. So two rows behind him 
is well we row four seat two Edith But it says a man with a hat and a fake beard. So Okay, you know what? It was seat it was seat two, row two, you know what? Uh, seat two, row four it is. Edith it is. In two seats on his left, there's a woman. So what do we need? What? So I've already forgotten. We Edith, so it's two seats, so it's Jacob. So we're already gone wrong. Seat two, row two. So then it's two rows behind, and well, that's, that's, that's only fucking Edith. I don't care. I, I fucking, you know what? Walk through king. What's what's next? Inside, we'll, inside you will find the ticket for a mystery guest named Maxwell. Seat two, row two. This gives you the starting seat and the instructions. That that's only Edith. Right, she's not fine. Two rows, right? Edith. So it it has to be Edith because it's two two, so it has to be the same seat. Yep. So it's Edith. And then two seats on his left. So two seats to the left. Of Edith is Jacob, but apparently Jacob's a woman. Uh, Jacob's apparently a woman. At the same seat as her, but in the first row. Well, just look at that. There isn't a uh, seat for. So I'm already. I'm, I'm fuck this. This gives you the starting seat from the instructions there. Working through, you should consider the following path through the seats. If standing. Wait, what? I'm sorry, I don't understand that. I'm sorry, I'm looking at that. Hang on. So my, sorry, let me just think. Right, so the starting here is knocked over. Then it would go one, two. No, because it isn't. Because this, that's the starting C. Yeah, so then it'll go one, two. Then it'll go one. Ah. I was looking at the wrong thing the whole fucking time. I now get everything. Everything has now been put into play. I mean, no, like, like this book is basically to say to you, oh, Maxwell's thing doesn't exist. That's where you start from. That's why it stands out. 
that was the whole point of this book. The note is literally which fucking order of the things. So you literally, thank you, but yeah, you start like you stare at the. You literally stand here and you just follow it and you just go. But you start here, and you go two back, so it starts like like there. And it goes across, then it goes all the way down to the first row, and then it goes to that. Everyone indicated in the thing, and then you go to this fucking piss myself, you fucking shit idiot. Oh my fucking god. And apparently you come in here and you input a code. So you go up, left, right. Down, up, right, left, up. No. Why did I have to switch to that one? Up, left, right, down, up. Right, left, up, down. Could you use those arrows of all the seats that you hit? So beep, boop, beep, boop, beep. Yeah. And you go all the way down. So that's really fun. I do not like that mechanic though. Why is the giant clown heads? I'm not. I told you I'm not scared of clowns, but that that is a creepy ass clown. Oh. Fuck off! At least I can shut the doors this time. And that yeah, that's just yeah, yeah cool. I hate this. Oh, hello. Cut the way you're juggling pins. Two hats in that drawer. Nothing in this one. Nothing in this one. And that's not creepy at all. Let's see if I can hopefully solve at least one puzzle. I mean, I've solved one puzzle, I solved the first one, that's all it matters. Case to start. Ted will act as a tutor, a clerk, and a model, and a judge. Who has to act as a witch, ghost, siren, and a guard? I'll I'll do that. I'll act. Don't worry. I'm clearly a good actor. What? Head. Anyone? What? At first, honestly, I was like, oh, cool, this is. Now go nice, nice start for this room. Good. All right, where's Ted? What's the hats doing? What the fuck's the deal with the clown heads? What? Where's Ted? Wow. 
What? What's Ted? Why, why, where, where does this Ted come from? I'm actually so stumped with this fucking room. Ted will act as a tutor, clerk, model, and judge. Who asks, who has to act as a witch, a ghost, a siren, and a guard? I'm actually, I'm actually, I'm actually completely baffled this, this room. Where's Ted coming to this? Who's Ted? Where's Ted? What? Is that... Where's... where's where? Ted... Nope, got nothing. Nope. Nope. There's a pattern in those words. It's in the middle. Oh my god. I actually, you know what? I, when I picked up this letter the second time, no, sorry. I actually thought, oh, maybe it's the, maybe it's the words. Maybe it's tutor, bang, DD, you know, T, E word, DD. And then I realized it said clerk, model, judge. So I'm like, oh, it can't be. No, it's the middle word of each of those fucking letters. You're ready. No. Oh, it's T O R A. T O R A. T O R A. One morning, under the bright sun, a lonely man started his journey. He was walking all day to reach the village. The night came, and with it, an amazing blue moon. The man was walking through a misty forest when he saw something strange. Someone not too far away was standing still and staring at him. He could not see his eyes, but he knew that the person in black coat was looking directly at him. He could not move as the mysterious figure started approach suddenly noticed that he had no feet he was not walking he was floating who are you he screamed terrified i am death he answered the person in the answered the person in the cloak days passed and the lonely man was found dead having hanged himself in the forest this place is since known as the Hangman's Forest. Ooh, spooky. Wheel of Fortune. Get out of town. The sun could be. The moon. Could be the high priest. Could be hermit. Yeah, could be. Could be 
No, definitely not. And then... Would not be. I definitely am thinking... I think we got the moon, the hangman, and the hermit. Know what the numbers are though. Oh, we got. Just give me a hint. Oh, no second shit. Um. We've got another uppy. I wasn't expecting an uppy. Oh, Simon said sorry. Is there a one there? Um, um, I mean, t take away the, the sun. It's the moon, the hangman, and the permit, realistically. They're the only cards we have that correlate to the story. But I'm not getting... Where the up and the down comes into. Um... I'm gonna I'm gonna have to do a hint. He's really upped his game. I'm not I'm not understanding the Simon says part to it. I mean yeah I did. Using the cards. Oh, son. So it would go... It would go like the sun. Then it would go... The hermit. And then the the night. So we go the the moon. Then the stereo thing. Things that I mean, there's no, it's death, not the devil. See, the hangman's one, there's nothing to do with the empress or the destiny or the high priest. I mean, that, that those are literally the four cards. Try to describe the story with the cards. Don't forget to look in the box. One. No, because if I'll, I'll tell you this right now. If it is fucking the cards and it's it's the Roman numerals on the top, I don't fucking know Roman numerals. I think I know I know fewer. I know X. I think I know X. Oh god, I I think I know X. I think I know V. IV potentially. I think V is 5. I think X is 10. VI. Okay, because like 4 on 6 are like VI and IV. One of those two. And obviously 1, 2, and 3 are like that. I think. That's all I know. I think. I don't know. I'm, I'm guess guessing. I don't even I don't know myself. 
I don't actually, I swear this is a fucking box fest for me. Alright, let me, uh, let me just go take the note from inside the box and read it. Take out the tarot, tarot cards and place the relevant ones on the order they mentioned. The sun, the hermit, the moon, death and hangman. It is to do with Roman numerals, so fuck you, but death. It wasn't fucking visible. Honestly, I actually had that. I actually had that one, because um, it was to do with the Roman numerals. I don't know Roman numerals, so I didn't know what to do. And the fucking death card didn't exist in the box. It was in the box, but it had fallen through the bottom of the box, so it was inside the box, completely fucking hidden. Go and fuck yourself. Yeah, and it's just... Each card has a Roman numeral on it, and these are in order XIX, 19, IX, 9, XV, 118, XII, 3, and XII is 12. Turns out I do not know Roman numerals, so I should kill myself. You'll also see in there, yeah, you should remove the, for remove the ones from these numbers and be left with 99832. And go over to the large box and enter 99832. 99832. I'm counting that one as my soul, so fuck you lot. Shut the fuck up. So I'm going to make this make a number of something, okay? I can totally do that. Masks. Zero. Hats. Costumes. Okay. I'm going to do this. Masks. There is one, two, three. Four masks. Four masks. And then hats, there is one, three hats, and I think there's three costumes. There you are. Oh, there was, um... Yeah. Hmm, let's go. My beloved dolls, they're always by my side, never abandoned me. My favourite one has always been... I can't pronounce names. Med Med Medrif? 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 No, not Medrif. Medrif. That just sounds like I'm just saying a word, not a name. Or oh, me adrift. Murdrift. Me drift. Me drift. It is me drift, isn't it? Me drift. No, it isn't. Murdrift. I'm closer. It's not me drift. Me diff. Me diff. Murdrift. Merlin. As my first doll. He is a special place in my heart. My second doll was quite. Was gifted to me in June. That was my inspiration in naming her so the second one is oh so it goes M Merlin June there is a small toy shop that not many people know about when I first visited I saw her she was my purpose mission collection I called her Annie and she was my third Merlin 
June, Annie? Before I started working as a clown. Here as a clown, I was just a regular guy. I was married, but my wife was a sinner, so I had to murder her. As you do. Do you know? Everyone's been there, haven't they? In my attempt to find somewhere to hide, I found this place. They told me that I'd be safe here. No one will suspect a clown. They can't even see my face. Sometime, I sometimes miss my wife, so I decided to name my latest doll after her. She's Dolly, and she's the weirdest doll. Sometimes freaks me out, too. So what? We go... Merlin... Ju Merlin, June... Annie... Merlin, June, sorry, Merlin, June, Annie, and Dolly. Merlin, June, Annie, and Dolly. Up, down, up, down, up. Wait, what? Is it just up, down? Down, up, down. Is it? It can't be. It can't be just up, down, up, down. Yeah, I thought so. Oh wait. Oh, there we go. So Merlin. Wait. Wait, am I supposed to do... Am I supposed to do right, down, right, left, up, left? Down, right. Up. How do I start with up? Well, me, Merlin has to be the first one, so it has to go right. All right, um, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna. There's only really two I can really try. So give me my notes again. Delete that one, and then what? Well, I've got. I'm gonna. We start with Merlin, so we go right. Up. Sorry. That. Down. Right. Left, up, left, down, right, and then up. Because the only thing, that, the only other thing I can do is start with up. So we go right, down. Right, left, up, left, right, up. No. Up, right, down, right, left, up, left. Right. Nope. Okay. So, not that. I just think uh, this doesn't make sense because it doesn't make sense for them just to do. Oh my god!
they are looking the opposite because I'm looking at them. It's the opposite, isn't it? So she she actually starts by looking left, and then she go, then it's down, and then it's left, and then she's actually looking right. That's up. Right. That's down. Left. It's the opposite because they are looking. It's the way they're looking, isn't it? Because I'm looking at them, so it's the opposite. I mean, it's the only thing I've like ever got, so I've got. Wait, hang on. I did something wrong here. Left, down, left, right, up, right, down. Sorry, right, down, left. Yeah, I missed out the U then, that's all I did. Yeah. Unless I might have missed out a letter, because it looks like I've missed something out there. Okay, left. Down. Left. Right. Up. Right. Down. Left. Up. Okay, we start with the up then. Up. Left. Down. Left. Right, up, right, down, left, let's see what the hint can say to me. Let's see what Watfrun King says. Inside the box, you find it. Uh, you can see the arrow site. Let me actually, let me kind of look, right? Let me see. I've deleted my thing now, but. Wait, that's what? That's what it did. Isn't Merlin the first doll? So, so... I'm okay. I, I'm, I'm actually beginning to hate you now, guy. Um, or gal. We're, um, team of team of gals and guys you are actually a bunch of cunts now no i am actually pissed off at that one again sorry my first doll was midrith first means beginning means the start not sylvia's the fucking start you Fucking punts. So it turns out Sylvia's the start, so it actually you start off by going left, up, left, down, right, up, right, down. I think I don't know if I got the down then. I did. Fuck yourself.
actually fuck yourself. Actually, fuck your actual cells. No, I don't want the door open. What a great fucking room. How do we? Where do we begin? Wait, look at that I'm fucking. Chunk missing there. How do I where do I, where do I begin? Oh Blue Stars. Blue and yellow stripes. No, oh, okay, I was about to try and get a hint as to where to begin. It really feels like there's no linear in this. It just feels like it's all just separate rooms to, to, to fucking solve. Oh, I can then fit in. I have no fucking clue again. You know what I mean? It doesn't feel like there's a continuation. It just feels like I'm just going from one room to the next. Solving one puzzle that is random fucking gibberish. Why is there a door here? What are these numbers for? What are these for? Oh, piss off. I swear to God. Oh, no, they're hoops. They're just hoops, okay. I thought they if I was like a, one of those that would probably be in the dark so I can't fucking see anything. Can I do anything? Is it on there no? Oh, it looks like there is. Is there anything anywhere that I didn't have or use? Do not think so. So, I feel like I feel like I need something to put in the projector. Give hint. Oh, I wasn't. What? Sum the numbers in each triangle, the number you get is important. Right, yeah, okay. But. But what sum? Math isn't my strong suit. It weirdly was at one point. I actually was in higher maths. And then I stopped going to school. And then I really didn't do math. Um... I mean, I can obviously guess there's a question mark. I need to figure out what that question mark equals, but... Oh, I now see the triangles. Okay, there we go. 2, 11, something. Yeah. 9, 6, 10 is what? 
0.25. is 25, so 25. So that's 13, 12. So the first one's a 12. And then 5 and 1 is 6, so I can't do that. Then we'll, so first one's 12, sorry, I need to remember that. But 3, 3, that's to 10. That's 14, sorry. 20. 20. So, 6, 14. 12 and 14. It would most likely go to that. So, 12, 14. Yep. Honestly, I wasn't even looking at that thing, so that's kind of annoying. Yellow is eight. Blue is six. Red is two. This is a math room, I think. It's... I th I th I, uh, I'm not sure. I mean, it's obviously has something to do with the four colors on the bottom. But I'm not sure as to what... If if they had it in like one, if it was just one two, oh it's one, it's a two. That blue, that, that's a fucking two. Oh my god, that is a, that is a two, isn't it? It is one two three four. Oh my god, it is. It is to do with math, but it's to do with um, colors as well. So orange, the first number is, I think it's yellow. Yellow and red make orange, so it's two. That's ten. Maybe. No, maybe not. It is eight. Am I not there with it? It's because they say that's ten. Then the next one is just blue by itself, which... Which is... 6, so it goes 10, 6. I don't think we have the colours to make purple, though. So my instincts want to say, okay, yellow and blue make green, and then blue and red make purple. But then none of the numbers, they're all, they're all too high numbers. Let me just try it. I'm going to go zero, six.
four. No. Zero, six, eight. Zero, six, eight, four. Zero, six, eight, four. No. That was all I got. Red plus yellow equals orange. Blue plus red equals purple. Blue plus... I was correct, yeah. Blue plus red equals... It does. I, I, I was just guessing with that, so I was correct, but... Yeah, yeah, so I, yeah, I, 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 I had that. So I had that. So I just managed to solve that part. But the numbers, it's not a four-digit code. That's the thing. And I'm pretty sure it's not. Hang on. Yeah, red is two. Yellow is eight. So the first number is 10. Then it goes... 10, 6. And blue and red. Which that was 6 and 2. So that's 8. So 10, 6, 8. And then it was 6 plus 8 is 14. So 10, 10, 6. 10, 6, 8, 14. That doesn't work. That's why that's why I just stopped. Then that, that was why I put the number in because I thought, oh maybe it's similar to the one we just take the one off. But I mean I mean I am just go back to walk for again. I mean I have it though. Wait. You can put two in at once. I tried that and it didn't work. That was literally the first thing I tried. I tried to put another color in. I tried to put another color in and it didn't. Work. You saw me do it. When I put the that was actually the first thing I did. As soon as I put one in, I picked up the other one and tried to put that one in, and it didn't fucking work. What the fuck? That's twice now I've been fucked over to finicky in this this one this one one. The fucking box at the start, and that thing because it didn't, it just didn't want to take it at the beginning. Because I, I, I think I might have been accidentally, not accidentally, but I think I might have been clipping the uh, the first cartridge too much while having the first, the second one in my hands. So I wasn't clicking in an empty slot. I was clicking on the cartridge, which that is fucking ridiculous. But the code itself is four, six, nine, seven. Actually, go and fuck yourself. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the other mouse. Said, so thank God, I'm not doing them in the same video now. Yeah, that was atrocious. Like honestly, I know someone's gonna be like that. Someone probably has done this, and they obviously people have done it, but they found it so easy. I fucking did not. Evidently. Don't run. I will say there was, I think, throughout the run, that I would definitely say the chair one, that one was my fault because, honestly, I will say I didn't even think to look for the chair at the chairs. 
honestly, that was easier. I, I mean, I saw the arrows. I physically, I was like, well, I have to open that door. Completely forgot about that. And just focused on that book. That's all I was focused on. But honestly, and honestly, I will say there is, I would definitely say, I hate, I hate this guy or gal. Like what? There was, there was definitely a few of the puzzles that wasn't my fault in the sense of I couldn't get it. Because the first one, I didn't open the, the way the new system is. It's the way he's done in this one. It's because normally you just click, you just click A, and it opened it for you. But it, I had to drag it, but, so I didn't drag it enough to pull it out. That's why whenever I was entering the code, it was doing the correct one, because it was the correct one. I'd already opened it. So that one. Then the next one was the 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 num the numbers with the letters. The the fucking grid wasn't existent in in it. The ticket booth was the uh, the, the ticket booth was a bit sorry. I said the ticket booth was a bit of an L. I didn't even I didn't even click the hammer, so the hammer the wrench. That was bad. The the tarot card one that was also a fuck off. The the one I want I was like surely there has to be there is a deaf tarot card. No. It was in. It was glitched in the bottom of the box, so it didn't exist there. It was fantastic. Not my fault. Also, I didn't know Roman numerals, so how the fuck was I supposed to figure that out? Just saying. And then the doll one, go and fuck yourself. Because you literally said in the note said first one is fucking Merlin. Sylvia didn't even exist in that text. He literally said the first one. It was a special place in his heart. For Mer- M- Midriff. The fucking Mer- Merlin. I'm, I'm not saying Midriff anymore. Fucking Merlin. So you can fuck yourself with that one. And what was the other one? Then that next one I figured out. And then the, the doll one was that one. So then the, I did the one after the tarot card. And in that room, honestly, I didn't really want to use the hint at the start. I didn't want to. So the, the, the triangle one. I was too focused on the color one. To even look for the... I didn't even see the question mark in the triangle. Until after it said triangle. So I didn't really shouldn't have taken the hint of that, to be honest. But then the colour one, that is stupid as well. Because I, I clicked it straight away. That was the first thing I did. As soon as I put one colour in, I went to put a second colour in to try and make orange. Or maybe try and put another colour in. Which didn't work. Because I, I, I think I, cause I was clicking the other cartridge, so it wasn't accepting it, which was stupid as well. So I would definitely say I would. I honestly, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna say it. I don't care what you say. A couple of issues with the way the game was, and I would definitely say you're a dickhead. Some of these puzzles that you j- no refuse for a, for a couple of them. You just fucked off. Or you just. No. But yeah. Thank you. I hope you all did enjoy anyway. Seeing me struggle a lot. But yeah. I uh, hope, you, hope you all did enjoy. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, you know. We very much appreciate it. And yeah, we'll do which is Oop. We'll do the factory next week. But yeah, I'll see you all next time. Bye. <laughs>